Hi there, grandkids. It's almost the end of April, so I thought it was a great time to read The April Rabbits. The April Rabbits by David Cleveland, illustrations by Nurit Carlin. On the first day of April, the sun was shining, birds were chirping, and a rabbit was nibbling on a bush as Robert went off to school. On the second day of April, Robert scared two rabbits across the road as he walked to his tuba lesson. On the third day of April, he thought for a minute that he saw three rabbits in skirts tap dancing on the windowsill. On the fourth day of April, he felt there was something rabbity about the living room as he watched TV. On the fifth day of April, Robert found five half-eaten carrots at the very bottom of his toy box. While fishing on the sixth, he saw six rabbits paddle by in a canoe. On the seventh day of April, there were seven rabbits singing with a cat on the garage roof. Eight rabbits left their bikes in the driveway on the eighth. All nine seats at the soda fountain were taken by rabbits on the ninth but they made room for Robert. On the 10th, Robert noticed 10 funny holes in the lawn as he took out the garbage for his mother. On the 11th day of April, Eleven rabbits on skateboards whizzed down Elm Street. There were twelve rabbits playing basketball at the playground on the twelfth. On the 13th, there were 13 rabbits in the supermarket. There were 14 rabbits on the clothesline on April 14th. On the 15th, Robert's mother took him to the eye doctor because she thought he was seeing things. There were 15 patients ahead of him. On the 16th, Robert found 16 rabbits making double-decker peanut butter and radish sandwiches in the kitchen. I've never had a peanut butter and radish sandwich. Seventeen rabbits in scout uniforms marched in a line on the 17th. On the 18th, Robert thought he spotted a flock of 18 rabbits fly over his head and land in a nearby tree. I think maybe he is seeing things. On the 19th of April, 19 tiny rabbits jumped out of a bag of pretzels and ran in all directions.
On the 20th of April, 20 rabbits in funny hats gave a birthday party in the dining room. There were 21 rabbits with him on the Ferris wheel at the amusement park on the 21st. On the 22nd, 22 crazy rabbits tried on all his clothes, including his favorite baseball cap. Robert found 23 rabbits taking a nap in his bedroom on the 23rd. The next day, a busload of 24 rabbits stopped next to him at the corner and all the passengers made faces at him through the window. Twenty-five rabbits all took out books ahead of him at the library on the 25th, but he still got the book he wanted. On the 26th, 26 rabbits took a bath in his tub and used up all the bubble bath. In the movies on the 27th, Robert sat in the midst of 27 rabbits crunching popcorn. On the 28th of April, 28 rabbits camped out all night in the backyard, telling stories and roasting a giant head of lettuce on the campfire. On the 29th day of April, 29 rabbits with suitcases tiptoed down the driveway and out of sight. On the last day of April, Robert watched very carefully all day long, but he didn't see a single rabbit anywhere. That night, a hippopotamus followed him home. Oh my goodness, I wonder what's going to happen in May. Happen in May. I hope you enjoyed the April Rabbits. I love you all. Bye-bye.